Hey new types, this is Spencer, and this is a new video format I'm trying out, so let me know what you guys think, and if you want to see more, let me know as well. Some of you may know that IBM Japan recently announced a virtual reality project titled Sword Art Online The Beginning. Yes, some crazy Japanese people actually want to bring Sword Art Online to the real world. Now if you've seen the anime or read the light novels, you might be thinking, this is a horrible fucking idea. And I'm here to talk about it, so let's get started. Applicants were instructed to visit vrmmoproject.jp slash entry. The application process was open to those residing in Japan who were 18 years or older and were willing to be subjected to video and audio recordings. In addition, they were looking for applicants with a height of 150 centimeters or more and less than 190 centimeters. You also had to weigh from 30 kilograms to 120 kilograms. IBM Japan were seeking 208 applicants. Accepted applicants would be admitted to the Sword Art Online Alpha. Yes, the real fucking alpha. The application period has since ended and they are now beginning the alpha test. A trailer was released titled Sword Art Online The Beginning Project. Let's take a look. Now you might be thinking, how the hell are they going to replicate Sword Art Online in fucking real life? IBM Japan is using an Oculus Rift Dev Kit 2, equipped with sensors that determines the movement of your feet, with a Kinect version 2. Several screenshots have emerged online, including concept art, gameplay, and where they're actually holding this mad fucking scientist experiment. With all this recent information, it begs the question, is this exciting? Yes, very exciting. VR has come a long way over the past few years, and I'm really excited to see it in mainstream markets. And thank god for IBM Japan to use a Kinect, rather than a fucking controller. Seriously, who the hell wants to play virtual reality games with a controller? Are you fucking kidding me, PlayStation? Are you fucking serious right now? With all this creativity coming from the series creator Reki Kawahara in IBM Japan, you would think Bandai Namco would jump on this. I mean, they released a few games of subpar quality, Hollow Fragment focusing more on being a dating sim rather than a dungeon crawler, and Lost Song having more Monster Hunter carbon copy boring multiplayer. My hope is to see that an actual Sword Art Online game be made by allowing these studios to collaborate. What we've been seeing of the series gameplay wise is very mediocre at best, for an anime series based on a fucking video game. I wish IBM Japan the best of luck on this endeavor, and I am extremely jealous of the accepted applicants. Gamatsu also reported finding 26 seconds of battle footage emerging online from the Sword Art Online Alpha. Let's take a look. Well, that's it for today. I'm gonna fucking kill myself. Let me know what you guys think of this video and if I should continue to do more of these. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, $5 PayPal donation, donate to us on Patreon, and we'll see you next time. Peace out.